What do we got here? Let's see. We got a package from one of our friends from across the country, a nomad friend. Let me see here. Let me put this stuff down. I was just doing a little bird watching here. Okay. All right. Oh, don't want to show the address. But, oh my goodness. Look at this. We got koozies, 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 buddy. <laughs> Look Ooh, at that. I don't see stickers. <laughs> we got four Banjo Joe koozies and there's stickers inside. Look oh my gosh. Boom. Look at that. <laughs> Look at Joe. It says... I'm at home wherever I go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. There's more stickers. Let's see. Oh, it's the same one. Okay. All right. So oh, we got the whole collection. We of might have koozies. to find some lucky winners for this. And then there's something else in here. Oh, I think this might be for me. Let's see here. Peel off the tape. And that. Uh-oh. Okay, what do we got? Whoa! <laughs> we got the Banjo Joe <laughs> exclusive. And, uh. Cut to you wearing it. <laughs> hold on here. I'm just gonna pop it on. <laughs> Let me just pop this bad boy on real quick. Oh, look at that! <laughs> it looks awesome! <laughs> <laughs> I'm channeling Joe right now. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> Step into the light. Yeah. So my my sweetie Ellie got me this for my birthday. Uh got me some banjo Joe swag. And uh I'll wear it with pride. Cause we love ourselves some banjo Joe. Heck yeah. And don't forget Danielle. <laughs> Well, we, now we need a Danielle shirt. Right. <laughs> she needs to come out with her own, with her own line of... Uh... Bass, bass player Danielle. Oh, that's rad. I love it. Oh, uh, let's see. With the beard. Does the beard cover it? No. No. He must have... He's, he's a beardy guy. He, he must yeah, he thought about this. He's like, you need a low logo. So. <laughs> logo. Low, low. A low, low. Looks great, babe. Thanks. Thank you for my. Awesome and they just throw those in. I I wanted oh, a cozy are... and sh koozie and and they 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 call them can huggers. I think can hugger. And um, they just threw all those in. So this is the one I would use with mine. So they're a matching. <laughs> you know. I think because if I go with the red, it's remember. a little bit Christmasy. I think I ordered know? the red one. Yeah. And then, uh, of course, black and purple. Those are cool, too. Oh, they're so nice. <laughs> Everybody in camp's going to be rocking the Banjo Joe can hugger. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you so much for getting me an awesome birthday You're present. welcome. Happy birthday, babe. And thank you to Banjo Joe and Danielle for providing these awesome pieces of swag. <laughs> Do I have swag now? Yeah. Yeah. And just for fun, look at how beautiful this is. Look at that. We ain't in, the, ain't in the desert no more. Nope. It's so tempting to scare him. Huh? It's so tempting to scare you. But we don't play that game, right? No, next time you play the game, we're, we are going to play that game. It's not going to be just you playing the game anymore. What you doing out there with that flashlight, babe? Making sure to protect you from, <laughs> you know, uh, anything that might go bump, scary, bump in the night. Yeah, scary things. And, the front of that shirt sticking out looks a little wine cloth ish. Oh. <laughs> um, I didn't know I was going to be on camera. Excuse <laughs> me. You weren't camera ready. No. So many things going on. You want to talk about it? Oh, this is weird. It's like only white. Oh, there we go. Um, yeah, we're gonna cleanse all the crystals. I feel like in the moonlight tonight. So we could talk about all of these treasures, and we could also talk about the mountain lion. <laughs> yeah, they're both pretty interesting stories. Mm-hmm. Should we start with your birthday? 
yeah, I got all these. I didn't get this. I bought this myself. But, uh, yeah, I got all these gifts for my birthday. We got Ganesh. We got a Lapis Azul or something like that. Uh, this one's cool. It's a pendulum. Let me see. I'm not really doing this. Uh, <laughs> well, but something to work on. <laughs> it's a uh, pendulum. And it's really it's got the chakras colors. Oh, yeah. All the chakras. I, I just built a fire. That's why I have black marks on my hands. This one, I forget what it's called, but it's really neat. Yeah. It's a... Uh, Can I see close up? Mm-hmm. It kind of looks like a... Like a chalkboard or something. It does. Like slate. Yeah, it feels like a chalkboard too. It's got very, uh, it's very much like that. This one's kind of cool. This one, I don't know what kind of stone it is, but it's, um, it's made with uh, deer leather. So that's what, this leather is like super soft and, uh, so pretty. Mm -hmm. People kept saying they were seeing faces in it. Yep. They thought it was, I had like a, a a charm, like a, what are they called? A locket. A locket, yeah. Um, but it says divine healing on the side. Yep. And then this one is a uh, kaleidoscope. It's pretty cool. It um, That doesn't collide anything, but this does. <laughs> Uh, there, you can like take this marble. This one's like a colored marble, but you can pop that out and you can change it to just a clear marble or whatever kind of marble fits in there. You can pop it in there. It's pretty cool. Huh? And there's a little prism on the end of it. Yeah, down to, in there. To make the yeah, make colliding. Look, look through this side. <coughs> I got two kaleidoscopes for my birthday. This is the second one. This one's just um, very basic. It's just a clear marble. And it's got a prism on the inside there. And you can just like, you know, just look at it for when you're, you know, feeling fun. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's it. This one we got, me and Ellie got together. And um, you didn't show your favorite one. Oh, you don't, I don't have it. You have it. I forgot about it. <laughs> yeah, this is my favorite one. This is like tiger's eye or something. It's really. And it's brilliant. called like a Markaba? Something like that. Mm -hmm. What it is is it's two stars of David that are, or it's a 3D star of David pretty much. Uh, it's two 3D triangles like interconnected. But it feels really cool. I could just like twirl it around in my fingers forever. It's, it's so very cool. fidget spinnery. Yeah, it's definitely very fidgety. So you got all of these out. Your birthday was like last week or something, but yeah. you got all these out because it's the full moon. It's the full moon tonight. Yeah. So we're going to take all these outside and set them out in the moonlight and cleanse them and recharge them. You're such a good hippie. And then me and Ellie bought this when we were in Sedona. This is selenite, um, but it's just really cool uh, material. And... Uh, not yeah. a sex toy. No. Mm -mm. But it can be used for like massage. Like you can like, like massage your temple with it if you want. Like yeah. It. You just really like holding on to it. Yeah. It's really cool. The pointy end is really cool. Yeah. And it's kind of interesting material. It's almost like shards. Oh, it's very fibrous. Like mm -hmm. there's definitely like lots of fibers. I don't I know if like I can it get could break really easily. But these are cheap. This was like seven dollars, so it's really, uh, really cheap. Yeah, you got your whole collection going, and yeah. there's your banjo joke cozy, koozie. Yeah. My koozie, koozie collection. Mm -hmm. With my banjo Joe stickers. Go check out banjo and Joe. My banjo and Joe T-shirt. I thought of that after I we stopped uh, recording, was that we need you guys to go over to the banjo the banjo Joe show. And check them out. They got an awesome channel. They're uh, travelers, just like me and my Ellie over here. And uh, 
but they do things a little differently. They just got a school bus. They're they're getting together. Uh, they live in the Midwest. They live in uh, Illinois, and uh, they're just great folks. They are awesome. They are awesome folks. They're better than great. They're grand. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're at Maggie's house. We're house sitting, farm sitting, and uh, we were supposed to be here house sitting for Maggie's new puppy and her cats and her four alpaca, but something happened. Paul's playing with the fire. Paul loves playing with fire. Um, don't try this at home. Don't try this at home. So, like, a week before we got here, Maggie texted me and said, something got the alpaca. And so, after some back and forth texting, we found out that the mountain lion came onto the farm and killed three of the alpaca and left their bodies in here like one in the woods one in the ditch one in the field and just like left them really only like like really got in like eight, eight part of um just one. one of them and just left the other ones and so then she had to like scramble and obviously it was like a lot to deal with and find a new home for the one that was surviving so she rehomed that one to a really wonderful place that she found it locally and so now we're here and we don't have to we don't have to take care of those little guys anymore because they're no longer on this earth and they're kind of on this earth but they're not <laughs> they're not they're not alive anymore um anything else so oh so we have a puppy to so, take care so of. we learned a lot about mountain lions and basically, um, it's kind of scary. Mm -hmm. It's a little scary. We're a little bit nervous about um, mountain lions being, being around here. We're on 10 acres in the middle of the woods. We're, you know, really huge amount of space. And it's a little scary to go outside at night. It was always a little scary to go outside um, at night here. but um, I never really felt like any worry or anything because nothing had ever happened. Uh, it did spook me out a little bit when I saw a skunk a couple times, like <laughs> yeah. last year, because yeah. I don't want to get sprayed by a skunk. It's not like I'm scared of them, but I just don't want to. That would be awful. Yeah. But um, yeah, I'm definitely watching my back late at night now. We're definitely like <laughs> hearing all the noises. Like, what was that? Yeah. Yeah. So used to, Maggie used to have some, you might remember this dog named Pinto, and he um, unfortunately um, passed away last year, but he he was... Um, a, a yapper, a barker. So anytime anything made a noise, he would be like outside barking at it. So. And she left the door open so he could just, he would just tear off into the woods, just run out the house and just like go so crazy. We were, like, we were never really scared of anything being around here because that dog was always barking. But now with new with the new dog, he's... Um, he's Super chill. He's super chill. And super he's, duper and he's chill. still just like so little mm -hmm. and doesn't really know what's up. So... Um, I don't know. I definitely feel a responsibility for looking out for him extra close. Yeah. Because there's a mountain yeah. lion nearby. Yeah. An expert came out and said that he's probably, the mountain lion's probably within like 400 yards of this place still. Just like hanging out. Kind of seeing what happens. Watching. Seeing. You see, the thing about mountain lions, you don't normally see them coming. You just get attacked, right? The back of the head. Arr. <laughs> yeah but so, also there's not that, that many that's not gonna happen attacks, so. <laughs> but it's still a little scary yeah uh, we're, we're watching our back we're definitely like on edge a little yeah. so yeah so we're not in the desert anymore we've been in the desert for a couple months and now we're back in the green 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 lush woods of northern california mm -hmm. and just just taking a little break from life yeah. enjoying each other well i don't know if we're taking a break from life but from we're taking a, van life yeah a little van life where we're, we're here for resetting. Weeks. Yeah. We're going to do a bunch of stuff to the truck, like clean it. Nothing big, like just clean it, organize. It's know, really, some... really sandy, dusty, dirty from the desert. Mm -hmm. Big time. Yeah. So that's, that's update. We'll be back in the desert, like in a couple weeks. <laughs> we're just taking a break. Yep. Anything else?
My love? Your mom. My mom? I'm a mom? <laughs> no, your mom. My mom? Yeah, your mom. No, your mom. That's, yeah, that's it. Okay, bye. <laughs> Thank you.